Hey everybody, Ian here with Immigration Finder. Shooting this quick video for you. I want to show you how to share a Google, uh, calendar with someone in uh, G Suite, Google Calendar. But um, by default, G Suite and Google actually has it set up to where when you share a calendar with somebody, you're not actually able to share it with them in a way to where they can edit the calendar and add events or maybe share it with other people, which is usually stuff you want to do if you're sharing a calendar with like your assistant or if you're sharing it with, um, or if you want to share it with yourself, so that way you can use uh, your one, one Google Calendar to manage multiple calendars. We have multiple businesses, or um, for whatever reason, need to, need to share it with someone else, and they need to edit it. So what we're going to do is actually, you need to have a Google, Google account. So go to calendar.google.com. You'll log in with your G Suite account. And then if you don't have G Suite, there's going to be a link in the description where you can, um, yeah, where you can, you know, buy it if you want to. So pretty much uh, what we're going to do is we're going to head over to Google Calendar. We're going to hover over the three dots over the calendar we want to add people to. We're going to hop into here. We're going to go to settings and sharing. So if we scroll down, we're going to see this. We're going to see add people right here. So click add people. And if you notice, if you click the person's name or, or someone's name in the email or add whatever email you want to add in there, you're going to see this, see only free slash busy, hide details. We're going to see all event details, uh, make changes to events, make changes and manage sharing. So li little stuff like that. So um, you're only going to be able to click the top one by default, though. So actually the account administrator, the person that owns the account or is anybody that's an admin on there has to go in and change this. So because what we want to do is if you want to invite an assistant or someone just to manage your account, you're not going to be able to do that with the default settings. So what we're going to do is we're going to hop in. You need to go to the admin console for Google. So that's admin.google.com. And that's what you're going to have to do. So type that in. I've already gone there. Log in. Do your thing from there. From this main screen, you're going to need to click the square in the grid where it says apps. And heading into apps, you're going to click G Suite. So in G Suite, what you're going to have to do is it's going to say calendar right there. Click calendar. So up here, we're going to see all these different settings to change. Like you can change. This is how you turn off automatic like Google conferencing in, or uh, Google Hangout invites, um, inviting external people. It's going to ask questions. The one we're going to want to do is this one, the external sharing option for primary calendars. So we're going to hop into here. And so pretty much you're going to click this. And you're going to see it's only free, busy information, all this. And these are the same options as what's in this screen right here inside your Google Calendar. What we're going to do is we're going to go to share all, all, all information, all managing of calendars. And you can also do share all information and outsiders can change calendars. So we're just going to do that. Managing of calendars. There's a save button right here. We need to click save. From this screen. We're going to hop in. We're going to go back to this side. So you see it's still gray. But if we click refresh, which is how it would be normally now, we're going to scroll down to the same area. We're going to click that. We're going to pick the email. And then if we click that, we're going to see we have all these different op options. So like now you have options to invite people to your calendar to edit it um, like and actually add events. They can invite people. They can actually manage your calendar for you, which is like critical if you have an assistant you're hiring or, or if you just want to invite like you know yourself to multiple calendars and manage all of it. So for example, you can go to the manage, make changes and manage sharing, click send. And now you've invited a new person that can actually manage your calendar instead of just having someone that can see your events, which is still valuable, but it's not really enough to like properly delegate stuff out for your business and allow an assistant to do that. But this is a quick video just on kind of how to share a Google Calendar in a way to where someone else can edit and manage the events. If you're curious about G Suite at all, feel free to visit the link below. And if you'd like to grow your immigration firm, visit the links below as well. Thank you.